Hey everyone, I'm Ben from the Academy of Geekery, and today guys, I am back with another video nobody asked for. Today, we're going to be revisiting a redstone tutorial I did uh, a million years ago, I'm actually not sure, but it was extremely well received, and I thought it just needed a sequel. It was just that good. And so I've decided what I'm going to do is I'm going to expand on that video. Um, yeah. By the way, before we get into that, a few things. Look, I've got my old skin from years and years ago. Second thing, probably more important, um, I'm hopefully gonna have a few more videos out before the end of the holidays, which is in like six days. So hopefully this will be an action-packed six days, or if not, I will have everything recorded in the next six days ready to go for the next few weeks of just a, a scheduled release cycle or whatever. Third thing, I've got a new microphone and a new keyboard, so uh, there's going to be a lot of noise in this video because I haven't figured out any nice way to remove the keyboard sound from my extremely sensitive Blue Yeti microphone. But that's a work in progress. For now, you can just listen to the glorious sound of Kale Brown key switches because that they truly do sound amazing. Right, so after uh, loads of popular demand, as we saw in the, the wild comments section of that video, uh, we just needed a auto furnace system that could go infinitely long. And I think I've come up with something. Um, <laughs> so if... <laughs> If the old design wasn't awful enough and didn't require enough redstone, th this bad boy, um, it's not even flush and you can't even line the chests up because it's, I don't know, man, it's, <laughs> it's pretty bad. It's pretty, pretty bad. I know. Um, but basically it works exactly the same as the other ones. I should probably uh, get this started up. Let's let's flick these levers. Get going, mate. Get go, bro. Go. There we go. Look at that. Awesome. 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 So as per before, this is your coal chest. Just dump all that in there. Get all of our raw chook. Dump all that in there. And we just let it do its thing. It's gonna start spreading that out along there. Look at that. Nice. Um. I don't know if it's ever going to make it to these end ones here, but 47 chicken. Oh, that must be from a previous run. Anywho, yeah, it'll start pumping automatically. Um, if you're wondering what this button is here, if you could even see the button, I probably should have put a wooden button on there instead of a stone one. Uh, and this uh, totally inconspicuous uh, <laughs> red particle giving off grass here. Um, this is the unjam button because this thing has a tendency to leave one item left in this one, I believe. Yeah. There'll be always one item left in there at the end. And this button here will send a pulse into this thing. It'll basically unlock uh, th this little timer here. And it will pump a bunch of times through the system afterwards to just flush out any remaining things in there. Yeah, so as you can see, I, I've been I've been fiddling, I've been doing some things. Over here, actually, this is... <laughs> I don't know if anybody has noticed, but I updated the titles of a bunch of my old redstone tutorials, my two most popular ones, namely the Hopper Timer and the Block Swapper, uh, to 1.14, because I have tested... These absolutely work. Demonstration. See? It absolutely works. Don't give me rubbish about it doesn't work in 1.14 or like it, I, I couldn't have made a 1.14 video in 2016. I have tested. Look, the block swapper works as well. That. You nerds are just building it wrong. Right. So. Look at all this chook here. This thing, this thing cooks at like one chicken a second. Um, so... <laughs> As long as you can keep supplying it, um, you, you've got a pretty quick food source here. And this is, I believe this is using 17 furnaces. Um, it was originally 16, but I noticed I could actually squish an extra one in down the end here uh, afterwards. But you literally could just keep extending this out. It, it can just keep going, um, which is pretty whack. Anywho, um, 
yeah, so videos will return soon. Um, hopefully I'll have my microphone worked out a little bit more for then because it's pretty awful to be honest. As you can see, I've been procrastinating a lot. <laughs> well, anyway, guys, I will see you in another video coming. Thanks for watching, and yeah, goodbye.